Hey, how's it going, my friend? My name is James Renhouse, and I'd like to welcome you to part number two on the simple science of invincibility. Um, today's video is called on always striving for active awareness, effectively utilizing what's in our power to control and direct our lives. I'm really excited to be talking to you about this today because if you got a lot of value from the previous video and if you haven't watched that, then I definitely recommend you go back and watch that, which is called on the grand law of responsibility. And because this pretty deal right here is pretty much just going to build upon what we was talking about in the previous video but if you decide you really just want to watch this video that's totally fine because this video is more than capable of standing on its own so with that being said let's jump right into it now the first thing now we talked about active awareness but i think it's important we discuss the inescapability of action and reaction hence we get the word um active from which there are really two things which you can never escape which is action and reaction now, I really have found out about this inescapability from Mark Joyner, um, the founder of Symbology, which we'll be discussing about a little bit later on in the series. But pretty much the whole idea is this. You're always acting even when you think you're not. Whether so you're deciding whether or not you want to say you want to go to the gym or if you want to go to the fast food restaurant, you're, make, you're taking a part in the action of deciding. Or maybe procrastinating. You're deciding whether you want to do something now or do something later or you decide to do something that you should should be or decide to do something when you should be focusing on something else that's also an action that you're taking or something even like thinking for example like a lot of times we get ourselves caught up in these negative loops or we start worrying or we start offline things that's also um taking action too it may not be like action like with your body per se but thinking is taking an act whether you realize it or not so once you become aware of this fact that you're always acting, you can really begin to take active control of the actions you take, rather than allow them to be passively selected by circumstances or the desires of others. Now, I think this point is really important because a lot of times it's very easy for us to get caught up in the idea that circumstances and things from the outside world just happen to us and we just have to accept it and there's really nothing we can do about that and what's correct in the truth of the matter is there's really nothing further there's really nothing further from the truth that's the truth of the matter there's nothing further from the truth it's that we really have within our own body within our own heart mind and soul when we just put all of that together we can go out into the world and control our experience of life so like we can make our life a beautiful and powerful thing but we only can do that by taking active awareness and things now one of the things that really like helps that really brings us down like as people as individuals in the world is really society and i love society i love being able to like communicate and talk with other people and stuff but i'm talking about society like what like the tv for example right like it's very easy to just sit down and find the tv and just kind of veg out for a couple of hours you know what i mean like that's not really helping us go out there and like make take meaningful action in our lives or well, social media for example right like you have facebook instagram twitter i mean you get all these different social media platforms that just saps away all of our time and stuff and we get more caught up looking at what other people are doing instead of taking action and making our own lives better and it could just really like be just a massive time hole and also you got like celebrity gossip right it's like these days like a celebrity can literally take a dump in the bathroom and it'll be on the news like freaking the next day or whatever. Like it's really insane like how much access and how much we know about these celebrities. Like we probably know these celebrities better than some of the people that we live with, like some of our families and friends even because it's just out there. And when you focus on that type of stuff, when you're focused on what's who's dating who, who cheated on who or what have you, I mean, that takes away from your energy and it doesn't facilitate acting in a way where you go out there and you act on the world instead you just kind of see what's happening in the world and you just passively just allowing things to happen instead of going out there and making things happen so really the key to active awareness is really just to enjoy taking an active role in things and also to enjoy your awareness you really need both when it comes to active awareness you have to take an active role in things meaning you have to go out there and you have to take action and you have to be aware of the fact that you're going out there and you're taking action on things and once you have these two things working together you have for yourself a really powerful combination so if you haven't if you're not taking active awareness things already then i definitely encourage you to start doing that start being more active in your life like if there's something that you've been wanting to do that you've been putting off i want you to go out there and start doing it if it's a book that you've always wanted to read it then go out there and start writing that book at least write the first page at 
at the very least or if you want to make a youtube channel like if you like what this youtube video is doing for you right now then i want you to go out there and go make yourself a channel go start your own youtube channel and go put content out there that you feel would help or educate or entertain other people now whatever it is that you want to do just go out there and do it and be aware that you're doing it and realize that as you keep doing it it's like a muscle the more you work it out the stronger it gets so with that being said, I really would like to thank you for taking the time to watch this video. And also, I want you, if you haven't already, to hit that subscribe button down below. So that way you can be notified. And also, don't forget to hit that bell icon a bell icon too as well so that way you'll be notified as soon as the next video drop in the series the next video that's going to drop in the series is called on focusing on the desired result just like the previous video we're going to build upon everything that we've learned already first we talked about responsibility then we talk about active awareness next now we're going to talk about the desired result so once again this is james friend house from jamesfriendhouse.com hope you guys got a lot of value out of this and i'll catch you on the next video bye for now